Evening guys, hope everyone's doing well. Today we have pipe 49, which is complete. As you can see, this is a very large pipe. This is a tall chimney. I wouldn't just say it's a chimney in the sense that this is a tall chimney for the purpose that the bowl is a hair under two and a half inches in depth. So it's a bit of a beast when it comes to size. Slight bent, got a really nice curvature to this, I like this line where it flows around and the same line matches here. Hand cut black German Evernight stem. This is a 9mm pipe. Craggy plateau rim. And the goal for this pipe was to have a rusticated base and slowly transition up to a smooth and I thought the best way to do that was instead of having say a straight line where it was smooth and rusticated you could have a fading effect so it dips up and down highlights quite some really nice grain so it's very uneven but it really adds a nice look to the pipe and it highlights some of the really nice grain that the top portion of the block had because it's such a, it's such a big block and you use it so much the grain at the top of the block was so different towards the base but yeah really happy with how this pipe came out throughout i believe it's a bit over seven inches in length and I believe it weighs in about 72 grams, which is not bad for the size of the pipe. But I would say that the pipe is balanced extremely well. It has a really nice balance to this pipe. I would actually say you could clench this. It's a pretty large pipe, but I would say it is clenchable. And the stain is a burgundy and brown two-tone stain. So in different angles you get more red through, and others is more of the brown. But yeah, so this is pipe 49. Really happy with how this pipe turned out. And I hope you like it. I don't know if I mentioned actually that this was a commission, but you can expect to see the next available pipe, hopefully again on Saturday. That being said, take care guys. Cheers.